Hello friends, coming to you from Milpitas, California. Nice quiet little trail called Coyote Creek Trail. Never been on here before. Milpitas is a nice little area in the Bay Area. Doing some training up here the next couple of days and I haven't done a video in a while. I've been missing you guys. Hopefully you've been missing me, but I was, I was taking a nice break, but I'm back. Before I get to my tip today though, would you do me a favor? and just hit that subscribe button for YouTube. I'm trying to build my YouTube following as much as possible, and I would be so grateful and honored if you would be a subscriber. Now, what I wanna to talk to you about today, email. Email's boring, Charlie. Why do you wanna talk about email? Because I have a powerful tool for you that can really help you, not just you with email, but also your team. It's something that I use all the time and is available to you in both Outlook or Gmail, whichever you use. And the scenario is this, you are busy all week long. You're busy in meetings, you're busy working on projects, you're busy doing your work, and you don't get to your email. Like how often does that happen with us? Many times. So at the end of your work week, you got a couple hundred or maybe more emails in your inbox and it can be overwhelming. And you're like, I just wanna get through these emails so I can start off fresh next week. So maybe Friday night, at 10 o'clock, 11 o'clock at night, you're like, I have time to process my emails. Or Saturday morning at 5 a.m., I'm gonna process my emails. Well, that's great for you because you can you know, relieve that anxiety, but not so much for the people that you're sending those emails to, your team members, your peers, your colleagues. So here's what you can do. Process those emails. Type out all the responses. Just don't click send. In Outlook, use a tool called Delayed Delivery. And in Gmail, it's called Schedule Send. And what this tool does is allows you to send off the email onto the server, but schedule it to be delivered to the recipient when you want it to, whenever you want it to. So if they come back to work Monday morning, you can schedule it to land in their inbox on Monday morning or maybe Monday afternoon. Give them a little time to start their work week. You can do that. It's a powerful tool. It's a win-win. You get to clear it off your list, make you feel better, and it doesn't disrupt their weekend. Don't do this. I see people do this all the time. Put in the subject line, please don't read until you get back to work. Please don't handle until you get back to work. That doesn't work because if your employees, if your team members are diligent, they're dedicated, which most of them are, they're gonna read it anyway and it's gonna disrupt their weekend. They're gonna be thinking about it. They can't do anything about it till they get back to work. So it's a wellness thing. If you care about their wellness, if you care about you know giving them time to unplug, you will use this tool. If you use it already, let me know in the comments what you think of it and any other email tips I'd really appreciate. Thank you so much. Hit that subscribe button. I'll see you in the next one. Take care of yourself and take care of each other.